And now live, Sandy, Utah, a so-called woman's intuition wakes up 33-year-old Stephanie Edson in the middle of the night, only to discover just moments before a male intruder enters the home and kidnaps her five-year-old little girl from her own bed. He had my daughter outside, my cousin ran out there and got him and her. The mother's voice, clearly shaken and distressed. This is, this is like four in the morning when this happened. And if they had not awakened 50, until 15 seconds later, that child would have been down the street and gone. My mom came down the steps and she uh, she just looked over here and she saw, she seen the guy, he was just crouched down right here. Please right hurry. Here. Can you imagine waking up in the middle of the night, something wakes you up, just a feeling and then you discover that just moments before you sit up straight in the bed, a male intruder has come into your home and taken your five-year-old little girl out of her bed in her bedroom. Straight out to Jim Kirkwood, KTKK. Jim, what happened? Nancy, this is unbelievable. This uh, What his neighbors up in Roy describe uh, Troy Morley as a super creep. He certainly acted that out. He goes into the home, grabs up the little girl, and fortunately the mother could tell it wasn't the little girl's um, gait because the little girl has a minor handicap and walks a little different. And that's how she knew there was something really wrong other than her intuition. So the mom wakes up Jim Kirkwood. No sound woke her up, nothing. She just sits bolt up in yes. the bed, and she starts listening. She hears nothing. She thinks she hears a footstep, but it's not her daughter's footstep. Suddenly, that, they look out, and they see a man. Imagine this scene. For those of you just joining us, you look out your bedroom window, and you see that guy walking across your front yard, holding in his arms your five-year-old little girl. That is exactly what happened to this Sandy Utah couple in the middle of the night. You know, 